Ava. And I'm Maddie. And we're going to be making the flower charm. And this is a demonstration of it. You will need one pearl bean, bead and six um, red beads or whatever color you have. This also works with buttons. And here's a um, necklace that I made earlier. And here's um, Maddie's necklace that she made. And here is a dem an, one I'm of the demons. I'm taping it up right And here's now. one more demonstration of it. It's a pink one with a pearl bead. Um, and I just finished making that one. The red one. And I'm going to show you how to make it. So, you're going to need one pearl bead. And you're going to put that on right next to it. And just... So right now you are forming the petals. Now we didn't tell you to put the pearl bead in the middle, so that's all you have to do. Yeah. And oh, it oh. helps you form if you put the pearl bead on first. Yeah. And so then just keep placing If you do them. not have a pearl bead, as you see, we did not find the pearl beads on this one right away. So she just did like all colors. Yeah. So that's fine. Sometimes don't get frustrated because these fall off a lot. This is what they look like in the end, and they're all taped up. And it, to tape up, you can't really see it, so you got to push it a lot. Back to Ava. So, I'm almost finished. I have three be um, beads, and three more to go. Two more now. But, um, make sure you press them on very gently. Sometimes you need more than six. Yeah, because sometimes people have different kinds of beads. Like bigger, smaller beads. But on the past ones, we only needed six, as you can see. Yeah. And this one. So, this one. So, um, you can see at the end, you're going to want to tape it. And... And you kind of tape it, and it gets a little blurrier. But if you flip it to the other side, it gets way lighter. Yeah. We'll so show you that in our video at the end. Yeah. And so the rest you put on, and I'm well, a, I'm just about to take mine out. And don't mind the background. Don't um mind the background. Um, that's just uh our little sisters. Yeah. Um, and I just got finished, if you can see that, and Maddie is actually going to be taking hers off instead of me, because it's going to be a lot of work. As you can see, you can see it more behind, but yeah. They're more scattered, no, no. They're not more um, scattered see, behind. at the other side, uh, the back, when you just taped it on, um, but then uh, if you flip it to the back, you can see it way better. Way better. So I'm going to be like snipping some things I don't need. So let's get over to the table. This is our crafting table, also by the stage, so. And if you just cut those sides off, cut the sides off. We're gonna teach you how to do a necklace on this one. So what you need is like this, um, this square that the, she well, has. You, you have to get your thing. Right there. Um, see, and um, what she's going to be doing is, um, actually you're supposed to be folding up your red one, but we just folded up the pink one since we already had it folded. And what you're going to need is um, that black string. Or any string you have that yeah. will work for this. And put it on the, like, non, like, non really, the, the side that's not really clear is what I'm saying. Yeah. The side that's not really clear, you should put it on. Unless you want it to be non-clear. And just let me straighten this out again. Um, so then you just put that on, put the two pieces on there. And the um, on. The, um, just taping them on there. So you tape them on, and uh, so uh, so you tape them on, and, and then you will um, then you will have your necklace, I guess. Yeah. So you'll see 
in Here. one second. Okay. Bye. We gotta run. Yeah. See, and this is what it looks like all when it's done. When it's done, that's what it looks like. Bye.